Are you looking for the best 3D printers? In this video we will look at some of the best 3D printers in the market. Before we get started with our video, we have included links in the description. So make sure you check those out to see which one is in your budget range. Number 1. Sovel SV06 The Sovel's SV06 made a lot of waves when it launched. The machine is a clone of the ever-popular original Prusa i3 series but for a fraction of the price. Where Prusa i3 machines can cost as much as $1,099, the SV06 offers similar hardware for just $209. That's not to say the systems are the same, Prusa's software and quality control are next level, but the SV06 manages to offer a similarly great experience for a very accessible price. Part of that experience is the SV06's auto calibration routines that handle the mesh bed leveling of the 220 by 220 by 250 mm fixed bed with an inductive sensor and level the X axis that rides on a dual driven Z, eliminating some of the more tedious maintenance routines. It's not completely hands off, though, something newer systems at this price point are starting to offer. The one thing to watch out for when considering the SV06 is its poor performance with flexible materials. The system's direct extruder with planetary gearing performs great with rigid filament, but we found flexibles tend to get caught up in the gearing and jam. But, given the all-metal hot end, you can still use more rigid high-temperature filaments than is typical for machines in its price range. During our review, we also found the SV06's TMC2209 stepper motors to be remarkably quiet, making for a tidy home printing solution. It's an excellent machine, suitable for enthusiasts looking for something hassle-free or for beginners who want to tap into the community experience of a popular system. Classic i3 structure combines with Sobel new design different from most 3D printers run by wheels in the market, SV06 has a classic i3 structure which avoids wear and tear of wheels and multiple replacements and it is widely applied into industry. We did something new to make it more applicable for household use. Modular design allows you to assemble SV06 within 5 steps easily. Working with SV06 clipper screen does not come with the printer, need to purchase additionally, SV06 can reach a fast and upgraded printing speed of 250 mm per second. Planetary dual gear direct drive Sobel self-developed all-metal direct drive extruder with planetary dual gear set, provide SV06 with higher drive ratio and a lighter motor, helps to achieve more accurate extrusion. Add large external knob for easy feeding. 300 degrees Celsius high temp printing all metal hot end setup makes it possible to print up to 300 degrees Celsius. No need to deal with PTFE replacement anymore, and even no need to flash the firmware, you can print with different materials better and more easily. Enclosure is still needed if you want to print over 260 degrees Celsius. 25 point auto leveling with inductive sensor. Detect the metal print bed through 25 points automatically and compensate the unevenness of the heated bed. The fast, smart, precise detection and compensation help you to get the bed leveled perfectly and get in fantastic first layer. Note, set the height of initial layer to 0.3 mm when you slice that would help you to print a better initial layer and make the filament stick to the plate better. PEI build plate The flexible PA coated build plate with mesh surface design makes the prints can be removed easily without any tools. 220 by 220 by 250 mm print size, enough for daily use and household use. Self-developed 32-bit silent board with TMC2209 drivers makes the printer work stably and quietly. UART mode is available so that more modifications can be done easily for advanced users. Customer service Sobel 3D printers come with one-year warranty and lifetime technical support. Any question on Sobel SV06 3D printer, just click Ask a Question through our storefronts page, report an issue through the Your Orders page. We will fast respond within 24 hours and try our best to resolve your every issue. Number 2. Creality Ender 3 V3SA The Creality Ender 3 V3SA sets a new baseline for cheap 3D printing, blending a familiar form with the beginner-friendly fully automatic bed leveling and self-offsetting to give effortlessly perfect first layers. Its standard features run to a 220 by 220 by 250 mm build volume, with a Sprite Dual Gear Direct Extruder feeding filament to a hot end that tops out at 260 degrees Celsius. Printing through the full height is served by dual Z-axis motors, ensuring stability throughout. 
In our time printing with the Ender 3 V3 SA, we've found it to be a little workhorse. While it lacks the flashier features and firmware of today's pricier machines, it runs Marlin firmware out of the box, it offers a fuss-free printing experience that's a clear evolution on similar machines from previous years. The removable magnetic print bed can be a bit fussy to return to position after a print, and there's no filament sensor, which is an odd omission these days, even at this price point. But all in all, a simple yet refined cheap 3D printer. Faster and lively printing experience, Ender 3D3 is a 3D printer can print it up to 250 mm per second speed with 2500 mm s superscript 2 acceleration, faster than most of printers on the market. You can complete models efficiently, saving time to wait for print jobs. Moreover, it can keep good printing quality at the same time. The optimized UI uses motion graphics to display the leveling process and other parameters, so you will know how the printer is doing at a glance, providing you a perfect printing experience. Easily start TO print, Creality Ender 3 v 3 ac 3 d printer is easy to put together in three steps within about 20 minutes only. It equips CR touch for auto leveling and strain sensor for auto Z offset. It is easy to get a perfect first layer. Leveling is the important process before printing, it usually make customers in trouble. This printer can save your time in leveling and easily start to print, which is friendly to all of customers including the beginners. Capable Sprite Direct Extruder The Sprite Direct Extruder of Ender 3 v 3 se enables smooth feeding of various filaments, including PLA, PTG, and TPU. And the extruder is market-proven for its reliability, as over 500,000 units have been shipped worldwide. Dual Stable Structure Creality Ender 3 v 3 se dual Z-axis synced by a quality timing belt, ensuring high print quality. The rigid dual Z-axis lead screws reduce Z-wobbling effectively. The Y-axis features two 8mm linear shafts made of strong and wearproof steel, which underpins a steady and accurate motion of the build platform for a lasting time. 32-bit silent mainboard and more, this printer equips a 32-bit silent mainboard with an advanced stepper motor drive to control all axes more precisely for less operation noise. The PC spring steel build plate is sticky and flexible, making it easy to remove the printed models by bending it slightly. Moreover, Ender 3 v 3 se equips the autofilament loading and uploading, one tap to load the filament, and one tap to unload it. Warning, please make sure the side of the power supply is chosen at 115V before power on. Number 3. Flashforge Creator Pro 2. It doesn't take much effort to set up dual color prints. The dual extrusion print quality is clean, with clear boundaries between color changes. You get the versatility of IDX for not much money. Flashforge Dual Extrusion Stalwart, the Creator Pro, finally got a meaningful upgrade in the Creator Pro 2, ditching the single print head design for a modern independent dual extrusion IDX, motion system that uses two separate print heads for a number of productivity boosting print modes. This level of hardware at the Creator Pro 2's price of $399 is a steal of print quality is generally fantastic with the benefits of the new system making a strong showing in clean breaks between colors or materials. At 200 by 148 by 150 mm, the build volume is a bit shrimpy for the possibilities offered by IDX, you're splitting that printable area between print heads when using them simultaneously, but for the ease of use and quality it offers out of the box, we can overlook this. Number 4. QIDI Tech X Plus 3. For its $600 price tag, the Chidi Tech X Plus 3 gives you a clipper-based machine with a fully enclosed 280 by 280 mm build area, the smallest on our midsize filament 3D printer recommendations, granted, but still in the ballpark of 300 by 300 mm, where we feel midsize begins in desktop 3D printing. It uses a Core XY motion system and input shaping, allowing it to print up to 600 mm per second in some situations. Speedy acceleration and a high flow hot and let it put plastic down at a rate that's on pace with today's top speed touting printers. The X Plus 3's party trick is an actively heated build chamber capable of heating to 65 degrees Celsius. Indeed, this printer is friendly to warp happy materials, performing favorably against similar style printers that lack actively heated chambers in testing. A filament dry box is included as standard, mounting to the back of the printer and serving as the default, and fiddly, but still removable, spool holding option. 
Compared to many modern enclosed style printers the X Plus requires some initial calibration, which is a bit old hat, but we found it to hold its offsets and, generally, it remained a hands-off experience throughout our printing. Overall, it's a handily complete package that doesn't disappoint for the price tag. It's not the prettiest printer, unless lots of plastic and an overinflated look are your thing, we don't judge, but it does put down plastic with speed and uniformity, which we absolutely rate it for. Number 5. Mingda Magician Pro. There are hot new speed-oriented large-scale printers now, and while the Mingda Magician Pro isn't one of them, the pricing pressure from the newer machines means this former upgrade is terrific value right now. The Mingda Magician Pro comes with the comforts you'd expect of a pricier printer, including a direct extruder, a simple-to-use touchscreen interface, a full metal base plate, and an excellent 400 by 400 mm textured glass build surface complementing the 400 mm Z-axis. The large print bed retains heat well and gets suitably hot, even towards the extremes of the build volume, not a given at printers of this size. Mingda's textured glass worked well with larger prints, though we found in testing that a raft or brim was necessary more often than not for smaller prints. For a large 3D printer, the Magician Pro is remarkably quiet, which is a plus if you plan on running it in a domestic setting. Not so great is the omission of large bore nozzles in the box. If you're planning on printing large models, stepping up a nozzle size or two from the stock 0.4mm nozzle provided is essential to cut print times down to a reasonable number of hours instead of days.